Hey Internet, how's it going? Welcome to another, to, to another episode of the John Graves Show. This is actually a pretty interesting thing, which has been talked about for a good while now, or at least for like the past week, and it is Capcom is exploring a Resident Evil 2 remake. And honestly, I gotta be fair with you. I don't I don't even know why they waited this long to actually make to make the thing. Because it does sort of talk about um Yoshiaki um um Hari I'm a hero by Yashi and talking about like how he was presenting the idea to his bosses and everything and that and that they got a positive fan fan uh, reaction and I don't know why they didn't do this back uh, say way back when they were doing this back on the GameCube I mean back when they first made the first Resident Evil HD remaster um, um remake when they changed some of the things from the first game making it less difficult and way more accessible for you know fans over there or well actually even when well, not well not necessarily making it way more accessible but pumping like that whole brand new feel of atmosphere and changing up the cast um, uh, at least changing up the mansion just um just enough to where that if you did play the original everything feels really 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 different and it actually feels like it's a very 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 dangerous place which is something that if they did necessarily remake remake Resident Evil 2, I would like to actually see how they would would necessarily redesign the police station. Or better yet, how in the world would they actually redesign the streets of um the um streets of Raccoon City lead, um lead, leading up to the um mansion, even going down into the laboratory and also the little um and uh and also the little the little branching way from the from the sewers to the um to the laboratory. I would actually like to see that branched up a little bit, even looking at Chief Iron's office and making it way more practical and making it just a little bit bigger because as far as I know, a lot of the stuff which is going on in this, or at least like looking at like the the original design of the of the police station, it seemed a bit cluttered, at least when it was getting around like Chief Iron's um office and where the secretary desk 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 was and having that super long hallway which which led to nowhere pretty much you know i mean like i would actually like to see that place redesigned to a bit of a more of a practical looking police station or or pretty much like if it still has this very like unique look i want to see it updated with like some brand new graphics or better yet well, at least, just not necessarily the look, per se. I still also want to see, like, different gameplay mechanics, different different ways how, like, that the zombies react. Also, if they do add in the Crimson Head and the um, and the zombie over time uh, mechanic, that would actually add a lot to the Resident Evil 2 game gameplay. Because, because that one is known for actually having two different... Um, um, you have Claire's playthrough, then you have Leon's playthrough, or vice versa. And depending upon the zombies in which that you kill in the Leon's perspective, or the Claire's perspective, or like like whichever scenario you uh, kill zombies in first, I would actually expect those zombies to come back as Crimson Heads and make the game way more difficult for the second player, even though one has better weapons than uh, the other. Meaning that, meaning meaning that Leon had the ability to actually upgrade his uh, weapons and shit. So. So if you're playing Claire's first and then like you kill like a fuck ton of zombies in the police station, it probably would be really fucking cool if that if you play through it with Leon the, the second time. Even though he does get better at weapons, he has way stronger enemies to fight to actually balance out like his his weapons and shit. That that's something that I would actually like like to see. But but also then again, in that same breath, I really don't know why they waited until this long to actually announce that they're about to make a or at least like, or at least even ask if the fans will be interested in a Resident Evil 2 remake. I am. I wanted that shit for a long ass while. Even though Resident Evil 1, it is really fun and very fucking difficult to get through. <laughs> like, if you don't know how to play it, I'm, I'm still, I'm still, I'm happy that like I'm cracking like the under two hour mark. But still, it's like. But but still, I want to see that shit in Resident Evil 2. Please let me know what you think about this down in the comment section. Catch you guys on the next John Graves show. Please keep watching and make you play video games. I'm out.